Good morning and happy Mother's Day. Jackson and Daddy came downstairs to make Mom breakfast in bed. Are you going to help me out, buddy? Yeah? Are you going to make the pancakes? I'll make the bacon and you make the pancakes? Is that a deal? You want to make the bacon? I don't know. All right, you can make the bacon. All right, so now it's time to make the pancakes. We need one egg, three quarters of a cup of milk, two tablespoons of melted butter, one cup of flour, one tablespoon of sugar, one teaspoon of baking powder, and half a teaspoon of salt. So basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna put that egg in a bowl, beat it up, kind of get it like nice and fluffy. Then we're gonna add in the milk and the melted butter, mix those together, and then we'll add in all of our dry ingredients, and boom, pancake mix. Pretty easy. And then we just gotta fry them up in the pan and we'll have pancakes. Oh, another thing that we're making for breakfast today is bacon. And I wanted to ask you guys, how do you do your bacon? Because I used to fry it in a pan or on like a griddle. But recently, uh, one of the meal service boxes came with bacon and they told us to cook it in the oven, 450 on the top rack for 15 to 20 minutes. And we put it on a burger and it was awesome. Like super crispy and done correctly. I think I'm gonna do that today and see how it turns out. I think it'll be delicious. Plus there's like a little bit less cleanup because you don't have to, there's not as much grease. I don't know why there's not as much grease. Maybe it like burns? I'm not sure. Just seems like there's less grease in the oven than there is in a pan. You wanna stir the, the egg? Let me make a little bit of room here. Here look, now you grab this. Okay, you grabbing it? Right, and now you stir. Are you doing it? You did it! You hooked out! Yeah, nice work! Alright, now we got the egg beat. Now we just need to add in our milk and our butter. Mix those together and then we'll add in all of our dry ingredients. So here's the problem, Jackson. That recipe made this batter a little bit too thick, so I had to add some water to it. I know, it's silly, right? So it's pretty good now. So now all I need to do is heat up my skillet and make some pancakes. You up for it? I, you're not gonna do any of the hot stuff, but you did help with mixing it though, so you did help make it. Nice work. You did that for mommy. <laughs> and in go our first pancakes. We're doing good, so we got pancakes cooking. We got bacon cooking in here. Let's see how it's doing. Oh yeah, looking good. All right, we're doing good, Jackson. We're making mommy breakfast, right? Can you give me a high five if you agree? Oh, you almost, almost. Don't do it right here. High five. Yeah, high five. Oh, you're like ETing me. Whoa. All right, here we go. Pancakes and bacon. I just don't have a tray big enough for like coffee and everything like that too. So let's go get Jen and wake her up for her very first Mother's Day. Jen, happy Mother's Day. You ready for breakfast in bed? Yeah. Here it is, I made you pancakes and bacon. Happy Mother's Day to you. Is there a song for Mother's Day? <laughs> I don't think there is, but enjoy your pancakes and bacon. Thank you. And then I'll bring you up some coffee in a minute. And the baby. And the baby. This is awesome, thank you. And I got a pancake on the stove, so I gotta go back down. Okay. How do you feel about the mother of all breakfasts? <laughs> These are really good. Yeah? Yeah, they're super good. The bacon is cooked like perfectly. It's so delicious. And you like those pancakes? Wow, they're really good. Okay. You want me to make you some eggs still too or no? I feel like this is a lot of food. Oh yeah. Yeah, this is really good. Hey buddy. No. Are you saying happy Mother's Day to that mommy? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> is that so funny when mommy hey, gives you? <laughs> he loves that mommy. He loves you. He loves to kick me. He loves to kick me too. <laughs> what a coinky dink. Is that so funny? This is what we like to do in the morning. Yeah. No. <laughs> Alright, Jen. What? So for Mother's Day, yeah. for Mother's Day, I contacted a good friend of mine. Yeah. And he mailed us something. Yeah. Um, his name is Harry Styles. Oh, our shirt came! So, happy Mother's Day. Let's see it. 
This is exciting. So we've been doing these live shows and you guys were like, did you buy Harry Styles shirt for charity? He had a charity shirt for COVID. And we were like, we're gonna buy it, we're gonna buy it. And finally we bought it. Oh, heck yeah. And here it is. It says, stay home, stay safe, protect each other. And then the back says... Love Harry Styles. <laughs> it says, this shirt fights COVID. Treat people with kindness. Yeah. Wow. So all of the proceeds went to, um, I forget which charity, but it went to a charity. So, what do you think? You like my, my Harry Styles shirt? Yeah. He goes, <laughs> so also. I love it. Thank you. For your mother's Christmas. What? I wanted to give you a million kisses. Oh yeah? But I got you just these hundred. <laughs> Thank you. Do you make the cookies? Yeah, did you read the recipe? Read that recipe out loud to me. Oh, they're peanut butter. Just read the recipe. Step one, bake the delicious peanut butter cookie. Step two, press Kisses Milk Chocolate into the cookie. Step three, enjoy the yummy goodness and share with others. What? That's the most vague recipe I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> they look so good. They're like, just bake the cookies. That's how you do it. Come on, just do it. <laughs> just you know, bake them. You know how to do it. Come on. That's exciting. What is this share pack, formerly classic pack? Yeah, it like, they changed the packaging. Oh, I thought it was like, used to be that you could eat this whole thing by yourself, but now you have to share it. No, so. I just, uh, maybe. <laughs> is it resealable? Is that, no, I don't know. I don't know. It's weird. Yeah, thank you, this is so yummy. Mm. I'm excited. Do you want the present that Jackson made you? What did Jackson make me? He made you a present. Yeah, let's see it. Okay. Okay. So while he's getting the present, which is in the garage, I don't know what it is. Um, the, I cleaned up all the stuff from breakfast and I have to say, I don't know if anybody is like me. I still have to clean this stuff up over here. But the thing that relaxes me the most is cleaning, um, doing the dishes. I love doing the dishes. I love doing laundry. Um, I also cleaned, last night I cleaned my makeup brushes. That's another thing that is just like so peaceful and relaxing and like a moment of zen for me. Is anybody else like that? It just makes me feel like, I don't know, it just makes me happy to clean things. So that's what I'm doing for Mother's Day. But let's see, so you came in from the garage. All right, you ready? Yeah, let's see it. This is Jackson's Mother's Day gift to you. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so cute. Yeah. What the heck, how did he do that? <laughs> he's, he's really good at painting. <laughs> Jackson, you made this for mommy? Do you remember making this? Did you make this for mommy? You remember trying to eat it down here? Oh my god. Did you eat it? You can't eat paper and paint. What the heck? What are you doing? Is that so funny? Yeah. <laughs> this is so cute. Really? Oh my god. How did you do this? Sorry, I was trying to show my face. How uh, did you... What? I love it. This is adorable. What is this? What? what I'm confused. Did They're he... little flowers. No, but like, what? What are like? What did he do? How did he do it? With his fingers. He finger painted it. <laughs> the only thing that Daddy did was the stems. You and Daddy painted me a picture. You remember doing that? I can't believe my little artist, my little Picasso. Yeah. Thank you so much. Did you use those fingies to paint me a finger painting? Are they so yummy? Yeah, they're so <laughs> yummy. Oh. Yeah, so I we'll put in it. the footage of Jackson making this right now. Oh, I haven't seen it, so I'm excited to see it. And mm. I'm, I'm editing, like once this video has gone up, I have edited it, so I imagine it was very cute, but I haven't seen it yet. All right guys, we gotta be quiet. Jen's in the other room editing, but I wanted to show you guys what I have planned for her for Mother's Day. I'm gonna try to get Jackson to help me out and make her something. All right, buddy. We're gonna try to make mom a fun surprise gift for Mother's yeah. Day. I have a feeling this is gonna turn out like a huge mess, but we're gonna try, right? Give me a thumbs up if you're with me. Give me a high five if you're up for it. Uh, make a face with drool coming out of your mouth if you're up for it. All right, good enough. He loves chewing on these things, but it kind of looks like he's ready to break bad, doesn't it? All right, here's your tray. I'm gonna put your tray on. Okay.
right? Looking good, buddy. So far, so good. Okay, here's your paper. Okay. We're gonna make a beautiful piece of artwork for mom, okay? So what do you think? Should, we're gonna start with green. Here's what we're gonna do, buddy. We're gonna dip your hand in the paint, right? Just, just your fingers, right? Ooh, it feels weird, doesn't it? And then we're gonna start by making some grass here. Okay? Ooh, yeah, I, th I think, oh, oh, okay. You're making beautiful grass. There you go. Yeah. Oh, you're doing great, buddy. Look at you. Wow. Yeah. You're doing really good. Nice work. So let's get the green again. Okay. And we'll get our hands in there. You gonna spread your hand out? And spread your hand. There you go. Yeah. Oh no, that's my watch. All right. Now we need to do some some big flower stems, like that. Yeah. There you go. Okay. You're doing great, buddy. Oh, you don't like it? No, 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 no. Look at that. He is an artist. Yeah. You are an artiste. What do you say we move to, we want to do some red flowers? Oh dear, okay. All right, you ready? Here comes the red. Ooh, oh yeah, there you go. So now, we need to do like this, and then like this, and then like this. And then like this. And that kind of looks like a bird. I think we need to make a few adjustments here to the red. What do you think? Like right here? You should do some like coloring like that. Okay, that's pretty good. And then this one, can you reach it? Yeah. This one's uh, this one's pretty interesting over here. What do you think? You think you need some some like little speckles around it? I think that'll be pretty good, right? Speckles. Now we need a little bit of yellow, right, to do the sun. All right. Which side, which side do you want the sun to be on? This side or this side? Yes, I think I see you pointing this way. Okay, so that's what we'll do. A little bit of yellow paint on your hands here. Okay. Ooh, does it feel so weird? And then we'll do like a, oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun. Won't you come out and play? Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, you are shining away. Yeah, that was good. You did great, buddy. Wow. All right, let's get you cleaned up. And then Daddy just needs to make a few adjustments and I think we're done. And by adjustments, I mean, I just need to add some stems to your flowers. But the, the majority of the, of the masterpiece is yours. There it is. There's your masterpiece, Jackson. What do you think? I think you did really good. I, I think you have a future in art. Admittedly, I wasn't sure how this was gonna turn out, but I think, I think it turned out A-OK. -okay. Like for a five month old, right? It's got grass, it's got flowers, it's got the sunshine. I think my favorite part is where he tried to eat it. This is awesome. We should frame it, can we frame it? I think so. Except for this part. <laughs> That's the best part. <laughs> I, wanted, I wasn't sure where to write. I wanted to write like Happy Mother's Day or something on it. I think we should write on the back the, the yeah. year so that we know what year like it was. how old he was? Yeah. This almost made me cry. Like I was there making it with him and then when I brought it in from the garage and showed you, it was, it was a little emotional. It is so awesome. I love it. I love it. <laughs>
I can't believe he made this. I can't believe you made this for your mom. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, buddy. I brought that mommy her lunch. Say, we were just having lunch too. Yeah, you ready yeah. for your lunch? Look, at, I, I love that he like eats his toes now. I know, here's your lunch. What? <laughs> That's all you get is three kisses. Yum. So, you actually made me a chicken salad melt, which I love. I've been eating these for the past couple of days. They're very delicious. And you got me some hot Cheetos. Flaming hot Cheetos and... Oh, and Coca-Cola. A Coca-Cola. So these are things that I love that I don't get all the time because I try not to eat so poorly, um, especially now that we've been like quarantined. I feel like we've been eating a lot more healthy. Well, he healthier than we were before. But today's the day of junk food. Yeah. And I'm gonna stay in my pajamas all day. I can. And eat flaming hot Cheetos and a lot of cheese and later hopefully a lot of like cookies. Oh yeah. I'm editing the video still for hopefully you watched yesterday's video where we did some like stuff around the house. Um, but I just watched the footage of Jackson painting the painting for me. That was so cute. Wasn't it? It was so cute. Like the cutest thing ever. So um, thank you for doing that. Yeah, no worries. That was really awesome. Still got one more thing coming. What? I'm not going to tell you. It's a surprise. <laughs> I love the little painting that you did. You did so good. Yeah. <laughs> you did such a good job. And I think we should try to figure out how to frame it. Yeah. Where should we put it? I don't know. Like, should it go in my office or should we put it? Sure. Why not? Hmm. Okay. Also, one thing I don't think we've showed you guys. Oh, yeah. Our friend Jeff Delgado did this digital painting for us and we just got the print in the mail. It's so good. It's real good, isn't it? It's like, the, he's so good. You want to see what Jackson thinks of it? What do you think of this well, I was painting? gonna hold it up next to him really quick. Oh, okay. So they could see like... Oh yeah, let's see. Side by side. Oh no, your foot's in the way, buddy. Oh no. What do you think? It looks real good. Doesn't it look just like him? Let's show him. You want to see it? Who's that baby? You see that baby? Do you see that baby? Do you love him? <laughs> the other day we showed it to him and he could not stop laughing. Yeah. He just I think... like kept laughing at it. So for dinner for Mother's Day, I'm gonna make Jen pizza, but I didn't get the pre-made crust, so I'm going to attempt to make my own crust for pizza from scratch. We'll see how this goes. So in this bowl, I've got flour, salt, a little bit of extra sugar, and then I'm gonna add in my yeast mixture, and then I'm gonna put a little bit of olive oil in there too in order to make the dough, and I think that's it. And then we have to put it into this big bowl that we will coat with oil to let it rise. And now we just let it sit so it can rise. Oh yeah, that pizza dough is looking good. Now I just need to uh, preheat the oven, and then we'll roll the dough out and make it into a shape of a pizza, and then bake it up. One day I'll be good at forming a uniform and round pizza crust. Today is not that day. All right, there's my pizza. I actually finished one of the pizzas, but this one's going in the oven right now. There it is, just went in the oven. I set it for 13 minutes. But I did want to show you guys the finished product. This is Jen's pizza. Ooh, buddy, that's a good looking pizza. Dang, I can't wait for mine. It's time for a sleeping baby intermission. Watch his little leggies fall. Oh, 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 oh. And back down. And then, oh, 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 oh. And then back down. And then, oh, 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 they stayed. So along with the delicious pizza that we're having for dinner, Tim also made a caprese salad with the basil from our arrow garden. 
This looks so delicious, you guys. I love caprese salads. I can't wait to eat this. So now we've had a chance to try our pizza. What mm -hmm. did you think of it? It was really good, and I was not expecting to get my own pizza, like yeah. all for me, like eight pieces of pizza. I ate half of it. I'm probably gonna eat the other half. Um, I just wanna clean up the kitchen really quick because the baby does need a bath tonight, and then I'm gonna get back into dinner and try the salad, but I also wanted to try to make a drink. So we have our basil, you guys know. We also got some fresh fruit and some lemonade. One of you guys sent a recipe that I should try with the basil. Yeah. So I'm gonna make a strawberry basil lemonade. It sounds pretty good. I think so. It sounded like delicious. So I'm gonna try to make that I think after dinner, maybe after the baby goes down. Yeah. It's just been hard to do anything with him today because he's been a little bit grumpy. Yeah. But, um, but dinner was really good. I think that the crust, I don't know how to change it, but I think it needed a little bit more flavor. I thought maybe we could do like a olive oil, salt and pepper, and like a Parmesan and some kind of like oregano or something, and then put that like on the top of the crust before we bake it. Sounds delicious. Right, maybe we'll try that next time. Yeah. But the pizza I thought was actually really good. Well, I like it. There you go. Okay, so I'm gonna try to make that lemonade drink that you guys told me about. So I've got some chopped up strawberries, and these actually are like super ripe already. Oh yeah. So I think this will make it even better if they smell super sweet. And then I don't know how much basil do you think I use? I'm gonna use this one, I think. Okay. Do you think that's enough? Yeah, oh yeah. Yeah, it it's pretty so fragrant. Good, yeah. Do you think I should rip it to kind of give it? Yeah, so, yeah, I think yeah. when you muddle it, that's what like releases the, like, yeah. the fragrantness. I don't know. And then um, just kind of mash it up with this. Yeah. Okay, we don't have a muddler, uh, so I'm gonna use our melon baller and just kind of mush everything together. Ooh, I don't know, it might not work. <laughs> I just wonder if that's enough basil. So then now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to put some of the lemonade in there, but I also want to put some soda water in there. So it's yeah. not all lemonade. I would put the soda water in first and then muddle some more. Yeah, would you? Okay, yeah. let me do that. Okay, I can't really muddle it anymore because of the water. Ah, uh, okay. I feel like this is, we're doing the right thing here. Like yeah. It's, it's gonna be good. All right, so I'm just gonna pour some lemonade in there. I think I'm gonna add a little bit more soda water. This is some mixology. I'm just kind of guessing. Oh and yeah, that looks really good. I'm gonna put it in this cup with some crushed ice. Yep. This actually looks so good. Yeah. This makes me want to be outside by the pool in the sunshine. I don't know if you can see, it is um, windy and rainy. Yeah, not looking so good out there. It was very, <laughs> like the camera never adjusted, but just oh, trust us. It was, it was, it's windy and rainy. Okay, let me do it over here. I'll yeah, just... dump the whole thing in really fast. Okay, you watching? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh gosh. All right, oh, now. That was the perfect amount. This is really good. Is it? Try it. Oh yeah. Right? That's fancy tasting. I love this. Do you know what this reminds me of? This reminds me of when we went to Palo Alto, we stayed at the Four Seasons, and they had that, um, what it was like the Italian Riviera or the French Riviera, like a pop-up restaurant inside of their like signature restaurant at the Four Seasons. Mm -hmm. This is, this reminds me of that. Yeah. I don't know why. That's immediately where my brain goes to is like I think sitting we, outside at that restaurant. I think we had a drink that was very similar there. I love this. You want to make you one? Yeah. Okay. I've got it on me. He told me to film myself. Okay. We got to this for Mother's Day. Oh, I didn't know what it was. I thought it was a board game at first. Oh, no. <laughs> no, that's cool. It's like, <laughs> it's a, a, a gift set type thing. And we do like his little handprints and his little feet prints. Yeah. Oh I think gosh. it comes with both. I think it comes with the <laughs> ability to do... Are you excited? I think it comes with the ability to do plaster and then you do a photo and then you can do like ink. Oh, I love that. Too, so. I think this is probably meant for like newborns. It says year zero to three. Oh, does it? Oh, okay, cool. Cause I was just wanting to make sure that his feet would fit in there. He has big feet. Yeah, they should. That's exciting. Yeah, Buddy, like, we're gonna do your feet prints and your hand prints. Yeah, Are you excited? You can put your little hands in some mud. Do you love that? And then it also comes with the ink pad. Okay. And then it comes with letters that you, so that you can put his name in the... Uh, like imprinted in it? Yeah, and they like give you this so you can like slide the letters in and then you just go... That's awesome. Are you are you sad because we're not looking at you? Is that what it is? I know. 
We can't look at you every second of the day. We can try. I know, okay, I know that upsets you. I'm sorry, buddy. Oh, that's so nice. I love that. And then it comes with different colored frames that you can put here as well. That's really nice. So yeah. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. I love that. Good. I can't wait to do that. That'll be so fun. I imagine that he won't be very easy to do it with though. <laughs> Are you gonna, you know what Jackson? For Mother's Day, I got you something too. What'd you get him? A gift. <gasps> a gift? You got a present, little babes. Oh, a carrot. Did you have a carrot in your pants? <laughs> Let's see what daddy got you. <gasps> what did you get? Oh, look at that. I got you one of those water, water, like water bed tummy time mats. Some of you guys were saying, oh, he would probably really love a tummy mat that is like a water one. So we got him one. Yeah. Cool. Just, I got him a very cheap one though, so hopefully it won't be so bad. No, well, we'll see. $12. <laughs> All right, Jackson. Mother's Day is almost over. You have to say good night, Mom. Happy Mother's Day. Are you going to give your mommy a big kiss for Mother's Day? Give mommy big kisses. Mm. So today, although it's not over. Ow, buddy. He's so crazy. Although today is not over. It's my time with the baby. It's coming to an end for the day because he's gonna go to sleep. Yeah. And uh, this is his, his bedtime, it's almost eight o'clock. But I feel like today was a really good day. <laughs> he was crazy all day. <laughs> he, he painted me a picture, which I loved. And we're gonna have to try to figure out how to frame it and where to hang it. And we just got to hang out with him all day. <laughs> I feel like, although he's like totally insane, I just wouldn't change it for the world. Like this is just who he is and this is his little personality. And he is just like a little wiggly worm. <laughs> and he's just, he's complaining all the time. He's, I don't know if he's complaining. I think he's just like, this is just who he is. He just like needs to be moving all the time. He's just making noises. Yeah. So it's time for him to go to bed, but we had a really good mother's day, didn't we? He goes, eh. That's a yes. So tell everybody good night. Yeah. <laughs> Say good night. I love you. <laughs> so a few years ago, somebody sent us an ice cream maker. I know that her name was Jennifer. And yeah. we haven't used it yet. No, but we've kept it all these years. We, well, we keep everything that you guys send us. But we've kept it thinking, we're gonna make ice cream one day. We're gonna, we're totally gonna make ice cream one day. And today is the day. Tomorrow is that day. Oh, tomorrow is the day. <laughs> but there is a little bit like pre-prep that I have to do. I have to make the ice cream mix ahead of time. And it wants me to make it and then store it overnight in the refrigerator. Like to meld the flavors together? I guess so, I don't know. Hmm. So we're gonna make chocolate chocolate chip ice cream. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. <laughs> but I have to put together all the ingredients tonight and then put it in the refrigerator. Yeah. So. That's what I'm about to do. What are you gonna do? I think I'm gonna take a bath because that was the one thing I In wanted to do. Ice cream. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Could you imagine how bad you would oh, smell? Oh man, you stinky. <laughs> but that's like one of the one things I wanted to do today. So I'm gonna take a bath. You're gonna do some baking and some desserting, right? I think so. You want me to make those cookies too? Yeah, I want cookies. Are they peanut butter? Yeah. Okay. You got it, dude. Thanks. All right, well that was pretty easy. This is my, basically this is just melted ice cream. And we have to make it into ice cream tomorrow. So that was uh, cocoa powder, sugar, brown sugar, whole milk, heavy whipping cream, and a little bit of vanilla extract. And that's it. Mix it all together, gonna cover it up, put it in the refrigerator until tomorrow, and then we'll put it in the ice cream maker tomorrow. Is there a trick to peanut butter? Like, I, I don't really, understand how I'm gonna put it inside of a measuring cup and then put it into the bowl because it's all sticky. And it's really like a trick to keeping it from sticking to the measuring cup. Got half a cup of peanut butter, half a cup of brown sugar, half a cup of regular sugar, one egg and a whole stick of butter softened. Now we're gonna beat all this stuff together. Perfect, nice and easy. Now we just gotta add in some flour, baking soda, and some baking powder, which we don't have any baking soda, so we're just gonna have to Double up on baking powder, I think. And then it says additional sugar. All right, I got my dough. 
You gotta roll it into one inch balls, roll it in some sugar, and then put it on a pan and bake it. These are gonna be very sugary cookies. I gotta admit, the most annoying part about this recipe was unwrapping all these Hershey's Kisses. I got 35 dough balls here, and they gave me an estimate of 36 cookies that were gonna be made. There's still so much dough left. All right, I don't know, we're gonna pop it in the oven for like nine minutes, and then as soon as it comes out, put these Kisses in them, and then put them on a cooling rack. All right, so the part where they came out of the oven was kind of fast and furious, because I had to put the Kisses in each of them really fast, but there they are, all 35 of them with Hershey's Kisses in them. Now they're cooling on the cooling rack. Now I just need to make a few more. Well, nine more is not bad. When I was younger, I swear to goodness, my mom used to cook the Hershey's Kisses on the cookie. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pop it in the oven for about five minutes, take it out, put the Kisses in, then put it back in for another five minutes. See what happens. The chocolate might melt a little bit, but then it might crisp up. I don't know. I really like the way that it crisped up. That's the way that it was. I don't know what the instructions to do this are, so this is going to be an experiment. Hey there, Mama. Hi. How's it going? Good. I took a bath. How did it feel? It was so nice. I watched some YouTube videos. I did like a scrub, like a body scrub. Ooh. It was one of the ones that was from the Four Seasons, so it was like a nice Ooh. bougie one. And then I'm also doing this foot mask. I have two of them, so this is the one that I'm not doing. But <laughs> it's a tea tree. Oh, well, you have it on right now? Yeah, tea tree Ooh. peppermint. Well, I have it under my socks. Whoa, look at that. There's like, you got like, like foot bags on. Yeah, so this is what the little booties look like. Wow. Oh, so then I put the socks over them to keep them like all nice and together and get all the gooiness all in my, my feet. Whoa. Yeah, well, because it is, it's like this gel. That's so, cool. Yeah, I have another one if you want to do one. Hmm, maybe. Yeah, so the one I wanted to do is called Baby Feet, and it's one that is like an exfoliant. It's a chemical exfoliant. If you guys have ever heard of it, it's, it's really... It's intense. Yeah, like I, but I read it, and you can't use it if you're nursing or oh. if you're pregnant. So I can't, I couldn't use it, which is kind of a bummer because it is a good one. Yeah, you like put it on your foot one night and then like five days later, your whole, like all the skin falls off. Yeah, it, for like two full weeks, the skin falls off your feet. It is crazy. So maybe when I'm done breastfeeding, I will do that one and show yeah. you guys one day. Cause it's like real weird. Tune back in uh, next December. Yeah, literally <laughs> in like six months. Or this December, yeah. <laughs> but um. But yeah, but this feels really good and it's supposed to be like ultra hydrating. So. Thanks. Yeah, pretty well. You gonna try one of these cookies? Yeah, I wanna try one. Do it. it does it matter which kind? Over that here? One. This one right here? Yep. It looks beautiful. Yeah, they look like, pretty good. It's like a perfect cookie. Do I just eat it all in one? Sure. Oh. What happened? It's like real melty. Oh, well yeah, they're still hot, I guess. Mm. Is it good? Mm-hmm. Oh, nice. Good. Well done. We're doing an experiment right now in the oven. Well. It's not well. All that we're doing is we're adding the Hershey's Kisses halfway through the cooking. Mm. See what happens to it. Yeah, see, look. These look awesome. So I baked these without the Kisses for five minutes, then put the Kisses in and baked them for another five minutes. They're like and all they're toasty. Like toasted. That's what I wanted. Heck yeah. Do you think they're gonna have like a burnt taste? Yeah, oh, they're gonna be so delicious. I you guess just you'll wait. have to tune in tomorrow. So yeah, we can actually try them because I think they're too hot right now. They're too hot and they're too melty right now. Yeah. Because like these didn't even go in the oven and these were melty. We tried some of these and they're delicious. So good. Well, so there you have it. Happy Mother's Day. Thanks. Yeah. Yeah. Did you have a good Mother's Day? I think I had a really good Mother's Day. Yeah, it was nice. We got like I got a piece of artwork. Beautiful I had artwork. A delicious dinner and lunch and breakfast. Yeah, and dessert. Yeah, and I was able to like have some relaxing time. It was good. Yeah. The baby was crazy. He was crazy. I think he was just celebrating. He, I think so. He was in a celebratory mood. He was happy to show you his artwork. <laughs> yeah. But um, no, but today was was really awesome, and I'm super excited for the like handprint thing. Yeah. I can't wait for that. I'm interested to see if it works. I'm it sure should. it'll work. I just I I. I think we'll have to wait until he's like asleep to do it or something. Right. But I am excited to see how it turns out. It looks so cute. Yeah. Yeah. So all in all, fantastic day. Happy Mother's Day. Thank you. And with that being said, we are off. And we'll, well see. Whoa. And I hope that all of you that are mothers had a fantastic Mother's Day or that your mothers had a fantastic Mother's Day 
or you know just everybody in general i just hope that you all had a really great day yeah so with that being said we are off we'll see you guys tomorrow and, and now, now it's time, time to pay the price, price.